Yeah, city of angels, that's where you from Whole lot of hoes, that's whole lot of bonds We don't give a fuck, we do what we want Throw up a star, throw up a gun Just by the mic, finna go stupid Shout out my uncle, Kondo Bullet, look what up, me the gang? Young Vita back again with a new video. Today we're gonna be reacting to Drake Trash Talking NBA Players compilation. Steph Curry, you already know, Kevin Durant, Warriors basically. And yeah, let's get into this shit. Uh, I want you to make some noise you for did. the number one team in the East, the greatest team in the land. In the East? I'm working on this new album for the city, and tonight, yeah, that's right. And, Yo, and, and by the looks Always of it, tonight drink this win streak is over, so let's go get it. Yeah. By the looks of hey, it, a lot of sweat. Is over, so let's go get it. Yeah. I never really seen him wearing fucking jeans. He's the best. He just did it. Maybe once in a while. He just dropped the lockdown on Houston. And... Always great to see him, but he addressed the crowd and the fans. Always great to see him, but he addressed the crowd during the commercial break. The trigger man. Drake's playing a little defense here behind Trevor Ariza. He's probably telling him, I'm calling you on the flip phone after the game. Talking to daddy. Here we go. Rockets down three. Ariza, they're out of timeouts, goes to Johnson, back to Ariza, they don't fail, Horton for the tie! We're gonna jump around and shit. In a big time game, and Drake, as he said, he called it. Pressure here on the ball, Patrick Patterson, be active, get your hands up. That's when he was almost balled, what the fuck? Right there. Trying to help the cause. And a five second! He always does this shit like that. <laughs> <laughs> Mr. Clean! Five seconds out there, man. Holy <laughs> shit. That was a badass bomber jacket. And he's unable to slam it down. Olive Green? I love Olive Green. It's one of my favorite colors. Now get the crowd going. That's got Drake out of his seat. Yeah, Mr. Queen! There's something to cheer about. Uh, I think tonight we started off slow. Oh, that's when he gave him the best thing. We put on the foul line 40 times. Shit. I mean, that's, you know, there, you know we put a team on the foul line that much. Yes. <laughs> we put a team on the foul line that much, they bound to score a lot. So, uh, but I think overall we played a good game. You know, after the first quarter, we moved the basketball well, and, you know, everybody was involved. And uh, this is Drake Knight here, and uh, he's the one who just interrupted. Give me a Knight. taste of what the uh, trash talk was like, what the, uh, you know, what the interaction is like with your your buddy there. Oh, you're a damn about no damn Drake Knight. <laughs> <laughs> Talking about uh, Big Dog and Billy Owens at his best. At his best. Yes. Yeah. Oh yes. Oh yes. It's a lot of oh. KD. Final seconds. And red hits from near mid court. A three from the rim. And that is the end of the third quarter. Kevin Durant has played with the astounding Damn, this is as good as he looks. He now has 38 points. And the Warriors are down by the Katie's jump shot is fucking great. Say whatever you want about him, dog, but that, at that height, to be that smooth, ooh, it's just wet. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. He talks a lot of trash over there on that sideline. So anytime I can throw it back in his face is uh, definitely a win for me. That's right. John, you're getting bodied by 20 tonight. Six buzz. Yeah, and Kyle Lowry's a fucking midget. You're for a monkey, <laughs> That's funny, man. I fuck with Kyle. We had the same birthday, but I only uh, watch the Raptors like that. John Wall. Yeah, that shit keeps getting low and high, man. Miles. Oh, he's just clapping and nine assists. 
Raptors will take a 2-0 lead back to the nation's capital for games 3 and 4. We'll come back to discuss it right after this. Well, we know Drake and John Wall are close friends. John Wall and KD, I guess. Yeah. And it's continued here tonight. Hey, this year, if the NBA season didn't stop, it would have been fucking LeBron for sure. For sure. Lakers, if it was Raptors, let's say, let's say it was Raptors. He would have been on LeBron. Man. LeBron, he did. Raptors playing with a pep today. Oh, Step Lowry, puts him back in play. Timeout, Washington. It happened, it's 24-21. There's another good defensive play. Nogueira with a deflection right. Back to Nogueira for the finish. Defense leads to offense. So when you're struggling, Drake, that gets him out of his chair. When you're struggling to score the basketball, what's the... The final six oh, of the year. Oh, and he got his good game. Look at the attorney uh, camp of the U.S. National team. Here's Steph Curry with that quick release. Some say uh, it's... Kobe's uh, last off side game, man. Ball in. Now nah, his big task is what he's going to do next, you know, and I, and I think he's got some plans and, and I look forward there. to seeing, you know, where his life goes from this point forward and uh, him, him and his wife and the kids. We're up about where it's like, it look, it's looking like a potential 30 piece right now. <laughs> Norman Powell looks Hey, low key, I don't know if you guys know this is, but in, in interviews, Drake saw so fucking white. He's like, up, yeah, man, it's so proper, man. You know, I don't, I don't fuck with like, you know, other dudes that do fucking that. He's doing some weird shit, you know. But when he's talking and he's rapping and shit, or rapping, he just sounds so different. That's all I got. Just listen to him in interviews and then in his music. You're going to tell a big difference. It's a red and white thing. But how about Amir? Yeah, I mean, we miss him. We miss him, you know what I mean? Great shot by Amir. Unfortunately, it's not going to do much damage with a score like that, boys. I ain't going to hey, Drake, what about the third quarter woes? You've been following this team? Sorry? What about the third quarter woes for the Raptors? You've been following this team. You gotta. I feel like I feel like uh, Jeremy Lamb has the answers to the Jeremy third Lamb. quarter woes like tattooed so on white. his right leg. <laughs> <laughs> it's cryptic. It's cryptic. Proper. It's drawing me in, boys. I don't know. There's something about it. What? What is it's that? Me, it's mesmerizing. Is that? Yeah, yeah. What do you ask for when you get that? You know what I, mean? I, I don't Give know. Give me the Da Vinci Code. <laughs> oh, Nagara from downtown. Huh? That's what you want. A oh. seven footer shooting threes. It's got to be the face tats. <laughs> it's got to be the face gotta tats. It's got to be the face tats. Oh, this guy's all trouble right here. <laughs> well, he tell Don't get me wrong. Oh, he's actually my favorite artist of all time. He's linty. He yeah, he's linty. We need he's your lint linty. rollers back. Yeah. Do you want me to linty. interview? Who do you want me to interview? Yeah, whoever, whoever. When do I take want. this thing off? Yeah, that was a good video, man. Shout out Jersey. Six God. My favorite artist of all time right there. Yeah, he does some dumb shit though. You know, fucking with the players and all that shit. Um, but yeah, thank you guys for watching. I appreciate it. Like, subscribe, comment, do what you gotta do. And yeah, you know what I'm about to say. Peace. <laughs> yeah, hey, I'm gonna say lates. In the next videos from now on, I'm gonna say lates. You know what I'm saying? Lates. <laughs>